Hi, it's Russ Snyder, CEO of Volunteers of America, Chesapeake and the Carolinas. I wanted to put this video together today just to communicate how saddened I am by the state of our country, the anger, the violence that we're seeing on TV in all our major cities and in several of our communities. This injustice has got to stop. All forms of injustice are just not right. We must step up as individuals and as an organization, as a church without walls, to influence change within ourselves, our colleagues and the communities where we serve. It's not acceptable to have racial inequity or injustice. We must speak up against injustice and create a peaceful and safe environment. No one should have a fear of their life or their liberties. It's just not American. I have several things I wanted to share with you around what I just said. First is we should follow as Christians the example that Jesus gave us in loving and restoring peace in our communities. Second, we must love one another in our organization, outside of our organization, exhibiting patience, kindness, love, and compassion. I was reading scripture the other day, and I want to share with you Colossians 3.12. The verse says this, Therefore, as God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. That's what we need to do, folks. And third, we must educate our colleagues, our children, and friends that racism is, racism is not acceptable and that all people are equal regardless of who you are, your race, your color, your religion, your gender, sexual orientation, or age. It doesn't matter. We are all God's beloved children. And finally, I'll leave you with this. We must embrace understanding and healing in our hearts first and then pass on to our family, friends, community, and coworkers. We're all hurting. Let's understand and try and forgive. Let's move towards healing. Let's continue to build our effort around stopping racial injustice. We need to do this for our nation, for our communities, for our organization, for ourselves. I'd like to close this out in prayer to pray a prayer of peace. So let's bow our heads. Precious Jesus, Lord, we just ask for your peace. Transcend across our nation. Transcend in our state. Transcend in our counties, in our cities. Lord, we need you. We need you to help guide our way, to bring love and peace and serenity and unity and harmony and equity back into our lives. Lord, give us the strength to go out and to stand up for what's right, to stop racial violence, to stop racial inequity, to stop all forms of racism. Give us that strength, dear God. And Lord, let us love one another within our organization, within our community, and within our nation. God, we ask all these things in your precious son's name. Amen. Well, you all have a great day. And I hope you can pass this video on to others who will see my passion around things have got to change. Goodbye. And just remember, God loves you. And I love you too.